Okay, so population health. I'm going to think it's safe to say that most people in our audience are, have never heard of it, maybe a few. So, Dr. Fialco, let me start with you. What exactly is this? I think it's safe to say most people, most people in the healthcare systems don't understand it either. But, exactly. <laughs> but I can tell you that. <laughs> Fair enough. It, it really is a, a growing and very important um, aspect of healthcare and how we look at healthcare. So maybe it's a very broad idea. So maybe I'll tell you what population health isn't. And if we think about the traditional way people are exposed to healthcare or healthcare providers, it's what's called an episode. You get sick, you go to your doctor, you leave the doctor's office, you're on your own. You have pneumonia, you go to the hospital, you get treated, you leave, you're on your own. And what happens in between doctor's visits, what happens in between an acute illness is really left up to the patient to kind of navigate um, um, their health care their healthcare needs. So population health looks at a population of people. The population could be all diabetics. It could be all people with cystic fibrosis. It could be uh, people who work for a particular company. It could be whatever population is, but using certain analytics, which includes data coming from various sources, and using certain methods like care coordination, people who are responsible to that person's needs in between the visits, but really over the course of their whole healthcare experience, we find we're able to speak to improving efficiencies, patient experience and care, which we'll talk about in a little bit. So the population health strategy is being responsible in some way for the total health of the patient and the patient population as opposed to just what happens when they get sick or when they're in a doctor's office or any other place like an urgent care center where they may get their health. And that's why it affects all of us. Thank you so much for explaining that.